Hello Grade 1, welcome to Makerspace. Hashtag online learning. Makerspace, Makerspace. Check it out, Makerspace. Makerspace, Makerspace. Before we start, I would like to say that I loved, loved your posts on Seesaw. You guys are great makers. So, for today we have a little... A little experiment with light? Do you remember the laser pointers? Great! Great! And after, we'll have a little art challenge that will require the use of light. Well, I guess it's time for science! I don't think so. And we have everything we need. We have a laser pointer and a switch that is connected to a satellite that will turn it on. We have a white wall. Well, actually, it is a puzzle of my neighbor Totoro. If you ever go to Japan and you're near Tokyo, don't miss the chance to go to the Ghibli Museum. Some makeup powder to make me pretty for this video. And finally, a question. When I press the button, I see light in here and we see light on the wall. But the question is, do we have light in between? Yes or no? What do you think? Okay, let's turn off the lights. And now, we're gonna get the powder and and no lights, no lights. And the answer is yes. The laser travels from the laser pointer to the wall. If I use something and put it in between, it disappears. What happens? We only see the light when it bounces on objects. So, when we press the button and we turn on the light, the light travels all the way to the wall. And when it bounces on the wall, it travels to our eyes so we can see it. If there was no wall, would we see the light? It would travel forever. So we only see the light because it tra 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 travels till it bounces on an object and comes straight to our eyes. Ta -da! So, what happened in our experiment? So the light was bouncing on the wall and would come to our eyes. As we were dropping the makeup powder, the light would bounce on the tiny particles of powder and would come straight to our eyes so we could see it. Ta -da! I can only see this dragon because there is light. The light comes, bounces on it and comes to my eyes. If I turn off the lights, there is no dragon. So, we only see things because there is light. Don't forget to write down your observations. You can even draw and color the magnificent experiment you just saw. Ready for your art challenge? For your art challenge, you are going to need a lamp, different objects, paper, a pencil, a rubber, and a sharpener. Turn on the light, place your object on the paper, grab your pencil, and start drawing the contour of the shape. You cannot reach all of the sides, so 
then you can decide to take your object away and close it the way you want, right? Try different distances with your light. After you've traced a couple of objects on your paper, use your imagination. You can start looking for characters or objects and keep drawing. Get some inspiration out of your objects. When you finish coloring, think of a name for your drawing. Mr. Cool and Mr. One-Eye go to the Cubic's house. Rubik's Cube, it's a house made out of cubes. Cube, Cubic, Rubik, Cubic, Zidon. Don't forget to take a picture to share it with me, with your teacher and your peers. Hope you had a good time. See you next week. Ciao! A good time.